Welcome back to Austin Live. Mm -mm -mm, that chili was good. Mm -hmm. All right, you might be sitting on a great investment and not even know it. The old stuff in your jewelry box could be worth a whole lot more than you think. Why now may be the time to sell and why one shop says they are the people you should sell it to. Take a look. Even in tough times, Cedar Park Jewelry hasn't lost its luster. Just look at the crowd around the display cases in the middle of the day. Well, it's, it's standardly like this. It's, uh, we've expanded. Our office was just this first half. We had to take over the second business here, which was the nail shop. We are now, uh, as of this morning, we're taking over the third spot. Jewelry business is good these days. It's good. Uh, you know, somebody didn't get me the memo that there's a recession. Uh, <laughs> I must have missed that one. And some of those who come through here are not here to buy. They're here to sell their own gold. So, well, yeah, I've been doing this since 1980. And when I did that, gold was at 290 an ounce. Of course, gold today is at... 1350 an ounce, 1380 an ounce, I believe. And, I hope you bought uh, a lot. You know, I don't save it. I believe in just doing the quick turn. You know, I make a small percentage. I'm able to pay my customers a higher yield. That's important to owner George Poe because he says while gold is more precious than ever, return customers are even more valuable. Our word of mouth and repeat customers are unbelievable. We so you've seen a lot of people bringing their gold in, cleaning out the jewelry box because it's just so high right now. I play a game with them. I'll do the numbers. I'll tear the ticket and I'll say, okay, what do you think you have here? Well, I don't know. I said, just take a guess. And I had people say, you know, $150, $200. I said, you got $600 here. George is buying up all the goods. He's so trusting to walk away while we're holding these, isn't he? Silver bars. <laughs> old class rings, old wedding sets. I'm buying tons of diamonds that people get left to them estate-wise, and they don't wear diamonds. You know, I get Rolexes all the time. Oh, wait one second. Can we look at the Rolex watches? Yeah, I noticed you've been eyeing that, Michelle. <laughs> Expensive tastes. Well, Jason, you've been looking at it, too, so. <laughs> look How at about that? that? His and hers. Or, oh. we, even the big daddy. Wow. We might yeah. not ever be late again, Michelle, <laughs> if only we had these. I would never be late. <laughs> they should make these And I would show issue. everybody that I wasn't late. <laughs> bad we only got to model those watches okay so if you don't want to get rid of your old jewelry did you know you can just modernize it even make your own yeah while we were out there we shot another segment with cedar park jewelry that we're going to run pretty soon and guys we have your back here because we're going to show you how you can still get your lady a nice wedding ring that is nice and valuable but maybe only half the price so we'll have that coming up soon that's what i call smart